Discover signal splitting with duplexers, diplexers, and triplexers, enhancing your communication setup. Bands, different pass bands, essentially. So for example, this one is a model CF530 by Comet, and this is split into 1.3 to 90 megahertz on one of the connectors, and then it's split into 125 to 470 on the other connector. I have another one which I don't have out. It's actually hooked up to a radio where I can't get at it easy. It's split up into three separate connections, and it lets me split out two meters, 440, and 1.2 gigahertz. So that's the, the triplexer, actually, that I have on my 9700. So that I'm using one antenna, and in the case of the 9700, it's on a very, very wide banded disc cone. And the 9700, for example, has three antenna connections on the back of it, two meter, 440, and 1.2 gigahertz. So using that super wide banded disc cone and a triplexer, I can hook up all three ports on that 9700 and use it with the one antenna, which is designed to receive and transmit on multiple bands across that spectrum, whatever the spectrum is. I, I don't remember specifically for that antenna off the top of my head, but it's very wide banded. So duplexer splits the signals by direction. Diplexer splits the signals by frequency bands. And then the same would apply for something like a triplexer or a quadplexer, etc., etc. And while I don't have anything fancier than a triplexer, I'm pretty sure there are quads and maybe even more than that. So that is the basic definition of duplexer versus diplexer. And I've noticed that those two words get thrown around interchangeably. So there you go. The more you know, right? So what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at the improperly labeled Comet duplexer, which is really a diplexer, and we're going to hook it up to the spectrum analyzer. And what we should see is very clear pass bands on the two different ranges. So we'll test one, one range at once, and then we'll test the other range, and we should see our frequencies rise and fall off as we see that pass band for that particular leg of this device. What is the use case for something like the CF530, this particular device here?